Have you ever been to a campground where this sewer connection is just too close to the ground or it's at an awkward angle to hook this into place? That is the problem with our hookups here at the cabin and we have seen this in parks as well. So today I'm gonna to show you a solution to that very problem. So I'm gonna pop this cap off and I'm gonna put just a regular hookup on here. And as you can see, this is at a very awkward angle. So it causes this to be too close to the ground and when I try to come and hook in the pipe, although I may be able to get it in here, it's gonna be very awkward and it's not gonna drain to the best that it should. So what I created was this right here. And what this is, this is a male end and a female end that I can basically attach to this here. And I've got a four inch piece of pipe going in between this. And more or less, all this does is give me an extension to make these hookups a whole lot easier to do. I actually learned this from my buddy Bob over at Blue Wave Odyssey. He used this hookup when he came to my house and I basically stole his idea and, and put it into here. But I did get his permission before doing this video, so he asked me to go ahead and shoot it, but I do wanna give credit to where the credit is due and where I got the idea from. So all you gotta do is take off your cap and with your male end, you'll leave your female end on top. And as you see, I've got the extension pipe. I'm just gonna screw this in. And all this is done with standard four inch PVC piping, which is standard, most of the time, plumbing piping. So now I've got this on here. I'm gonna take my traditional ring here and plug it in. And as you can see, now I have plenty of room to be able to take my sewer drain pipe and hook it in. Although I would wanna change the placement of it just for the example here. Now everything's hooked up. I have plenty of room and just a whole lot easier and better setup. So for me, I'm actually going to leave this one here permanently. I'm going to build some dirt in around this to make it more of a permanent fixture. But when you're at a campground, this thing can come in extreme handy when, like I say, there's one that is too low or at a bad angle or something. You can use this to get exactly what you need and uh, be able to drain your tanks a whole lot better because everybody knows this is already a bad process so let's make it just a little bit easier so again this is the complete product i will have all the links to everything that you need to make this down in the description below there's also some pvc cement that you will need but you can create this whole thing for around 30 dollars and this thing has been a lifesaver i really enjoyed i'm going to be making another one to take the campgrounds along with us as well